about a week and a half ago, one of my former students, Michael Inglesi, came to me and said that he has been working on this project legacy through a leadership program. And he said to me that he would like to help restore the bowling alley and the uh, Paris, old Paris Club area. They said it would take seven days. And he, true to his word, completed the legacy in seven days. We were greatly fortunate and blessed that we had our, our alumnus, Michael Inglesi, from our amazing organization, Advanced Education, come reach out to us and say, we could actually make that dream possible. And we were beyond amazed and shocked when we heard this from Mike. And we were so grateful. And they raised $5,000 in total donations and in-kind donations. They brought down a team of 12. And they spent all, all, you know, this amount, several hundred hours of community service, compacted and driven by passion to give. The school is 130 years old. And what I can tell you is that the community is as strong as it is because of places and organizations like St. Elizabeth's Catholic Academy and St. Elizabeth's School. They instill education more than just from books. What they instill is really the love of the community, the teachers, the, the entire staff, you know, all of the school is so dedicated to the children, their education, and really molding them into leaders in this community. <laughs> I too was a student of Catholic school and what I would like to do after being here is to go back and visit my Catholic school and see what we can create for them. We are so blessed and fortunate this school has such a vibrant support of the alumni base of over 3,500 and a community of you know over 25,000 owns a park in Woodhaven combined and we're just grateful that we have a place now for them to congregate, to share experiences and to really build a, you know, a lifetime experiences together.